Mike still here from Bison's TV, proudly presented by The Hub. Here with fifth year captain Tegan Turner. Tegan, how's it going today? I'm good, thank you. How are you? Doing really well. Thank you very much for asking. Uh, well, we just wrapped up with the CanWest Championships, and uh, not only did you receive uh, honors on the track, but you received honors off the track as well with the Community Leadership Award. Uh, what does winning that award mean to you, uh, especially considering the fact that your coach was very adamant that uh, you get nominated for this, uh, you know, because of the work that you do behind the scenes, uh, uh, you know, for the community. Absolutely. Um, it's a really great honor. Um, really uh, unexpected as well. I, I didn't go in thinking anything about that at all. Um, and again, I think it's just nice to be able to represent Bison Sports values, Bison Track and Field values, um, I guess, on that stage and be recognized for that. Uh, I think it's a really great platform that we have as student athletes to be able to uh, give back to the community. So again, just, just really grateful for, for the nomination and, and I guess the award. <laughs> And another strong showing for you on the track here. You've won, uh, you've gotten first place at Can West in the past couple of years. Another very strong showing for you with the second place finish this year. But more importantly, you're on pace with where you want to be training wise. Maybe explain uh, just a little bit about how your your prep for this particular year's Can West Championships may have differed from mm -hmm. other years. Absolutely, yeah. So uh, the last couple of years have been really great, some really great times. Uh, the only thing is you just kind of felt that we peaked too early before U Sports Championships. So. Alec and I kind of came in with a little bit of a different plan where we decided that I uh, kind of train through Canada West and just kind of see how that went. And again, I'm really happy with the 7.5. I think that's, um, I'm right where I need to be and I'm just really excited to uh, get into the U Sports race. In a time of 7.50 from the Manitoba Bisons, Tegan Turner. Uh, to the relay for a minute here as well. 4x2 team did quite well also, uh, especially considering the competition, including a tough Saskatchewan squad that uh, I believe won the banner for both men and women. Uh, so, I mean, considering that, very impressive uh, as well with uh, the way you guys finished uh, relay-wise. Absolutely. The, the women's U of S really has really uh, been exceptional this year. And so just kind of going back to when we first ran on the U of A track in January, uh, we were actually two seconds faster this time, which is huge in the relay. In second place in a time of 139.05, which is under the U Sports standard. Tegan Turner, Teo Babavola, Brianna Tynes and Aaron White, the Manitoba Bisons that uh, you know we're, we've improved so much and everybody's you know able to kind of turn it on when it counts and so knowing you know now that in two weeks we're going to be here running again I think uh, we've got really the advantage of being you know at home uh, we know the corners super well and again we're really excited to compete in that event. Perfect segue yeah uh, as you just plugged uh, Nationals happening here on campus March 7th and 9th um, yeah, you get to sleep in your own bed, get to train on this track, and uh, as you can see on here, it's a bank track, not super common uh, at the conference level or the university level for that matter. How, just how much of an advantage is it being able to have uh, the confines of your own uh, 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 track and your own just uh, you know, province for that matter? Yeah. Absolutely, I think across the board there's there's tons of things that are going to give us the advantage. Um, just again, running the corners, it's a little bit different than running on a flat track and we train on it all the time, so we're, we're pretty pretty good at those. And again, just having the home crowd, again, yeah, like you said, being at home, having your own bed, your own food, uh, is really, you know, all the things that I think are going to make us that much better when we perform here. Well, Tag, I wish you and your teammates all the best uh, as you compete uh, at Nationals and uh, thank you so very much for your time. Thank you.